So, this Wozniak started this Comic Con, which shouldn't be wonderful. As the years go by, it's got all kinds of wonderful people coming. It should be very successful. It's the first evening, you know. So, I would like to take the pleasure to embarrass him. <laughs> and we, we, I'm going to tell you a secret. Somewhere, we're way out of town. He and I are going to have dinner. And I'm going to have the pleasure. I've been looking forward to it for a long time. I, I want the pleasure of talking to him and, and, and uh, discovering what you think and how. Um, but I want you to, there's a microphone somewhere. I want you to ask me the first question. <laughs> where, where is the microphone? Where, where, there, Steve, it's right, it's, it's right, right there. Science fiction and engineering. I'm standing in an airport. What are you looking at? 
matter what, they love you. <laughs> okay, 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 but I want to know the difference. When, I know when, you, when you look behind you, do you think somebody was creeping up on you? <laughs> <laughs> Not with me here. I just want to see who was staring at me. No, they are. In wonderment and bewilderment and adoration. I was in an airport as you were this young man inventing this thing. <laughs> and I had a Motorola and I flipped it open <laughs> to make a phone call. And 15 people crowded around me and started laughing. I had no idea. <laughs> because on Star Trek we had this community. And the Motorola phone looked exactly like the communicator. <laughs> science fiction had preceded science. Except that I, as a young kid, had these dreams. I wanted to be the, the captain of a spaceship flying. And that we don't quite have yet. So sometimes we get them. We can see through walls like Superman. We can put on jetpacks and fly like Superman or water packs and things. Yes, that's what I'm saying. Anything is possible. And that's why your engineering, two feet on the ground, is too small for a mind like yours. <laughs> <laughs> I am, listen, I, I look back on my work. I was a genius once. The only thing I can be a genius at now is making people think, tricking them into thinking I am one. <laughs> It's a pleasure. I can't wait to have humor is the ultimate creativity, and you've got it. Thank you so much.